it's me Hope and today I have a video for you guys and today it is going to be a back to school tag and me and my friend Grace, Viva La Grace X, we made this tag together. I know that there is a back to school tag already but we decided that we wanted to make another tag and some of the questions are similar and some of them are different and yeah let's get started. Question one, what grade are you going into? This year I'm going to be going into 10th grade, which is my second year in high school, and I'm going to be a sophomore. Number two, what are your favorite and least favorite things about school? My favorite is definitely, um, well, if it means, like, just school in general, um, my, like, classes and stuff, my favorite classes were definitely, like, the extra classes, like, art and, uh, PE and all those, and then, uh, just in, like, general, like, just going to school and stuff, my favorite thing is, um, just meeting new people and having new friends and seeing your old friends and all that. And then my least favorite thing about school, like classes, is English definitely because I'm just so bad at it. And then um, my least favorite thing just in general about school is just all the extra work that I have to do because YouTube gymnastics and cheerleading plus homework, it's just so hard and complicated for me to like um, just do it, like do the homework and I end up not turning it in, which is really bad, and I really do need to focus on schoolwork, but yeah. Number three, what day do you go back to school? And I'm pretty sure I go back August 22nd, which means I only have one month left of school and one month left of this back to school series, and that is so sad, and uh, I just like making videos three days a week, but I definitely won't be able to do that during the school year. What time are you going to wake up? And if this means like on the first day of school, I'm definitely going to wake up at 5 or 5.30, like between those times, and I'm going to set alarms. I'm going to set my first alarm for 5 and then set uh, multiple alarms through to 5.30, so I'll wake up between that time because on the first day, I just need to get my head back in the game and kind of like... Uh, get used to getting ready again, so I'm going to need a lot more time on the first few days. How long does it take for you to get ready? Um, at the beginning of the school year, as I said, like, it takes me a lot longer. Um, definitely, like, an hour to two hours. Like, I know that's ridiculous, but I need time to do, like, everything, like, getting my makeup, my hair, picking out my outfit, eating breakfast. Sometimes I take showers in the morning, but I usually take them at night, but, um, that, and then, like, just kind of, just, like, chilling out because I need time to, like, process through my, like, like, kind of wake up in the morning before I go to school so I'm not sleeping all day. And definitely by the end of the school year, it can take me 30 minutes, um, to get ready or less because I definitely wake up a lot later because I get a lot lazier. Question number six, what are you excited and nervous for? This year I'm doing high school gymnastics, which is really exciting because I didn't do it last year, so I'm very, very excited for that, and just, yeah, doing high school gymnastics, and I'm really excited for my cheer team this year. And what I'm really nervous for this year is just my grades in general, because last year I definitely did not get um, the best grades that I could have gotten, so I really need to focus on school a lot, so I'm really nervous that I'm not going to get the grades that I really want, but I mean, if I try, I definitely can, and I definitely, hopefully will. Do you have your schedule yet? If so, share it. And I do not have my actual schedule, like the order of the classes I'm taking, but I do know what classes I'm taking. This year I'm taking the four main classes, obviously, that you have to. Um, I'm taking three honors classes and one not honors class, and I'm doing honors geometry, honors world history, honors physics, and then I'm taking, um, the one class that I'm not doing honors on this year is English, because as I said, I'm very bad at English. And and then I'm also going to be taking Spanish this year, and then hopefully I'm going to get photography this year because photography is a very hard class to get into it, like because when you're a sophomore, because a lot of juniors and seniors want to take it. And, and then I'm also doing a study hall for half the semester. And then also gym, and then yeah. Where do you normally get your school supplies? I'm definitely not as school supplies like obsessed as most beauty gurus. I'm definitely, I just like get my school supplies the week after school starts because that's when they tell you everything you need because my teachers are just like, okay, you're going to need this and this and this for the school year and that's when you usually get it at my school. Um, and definitely just like Walmart, uh, sometimes Target, uh, Office Max. 
jeans, yoga pants, or skirts. Um, last year I was definitely a like. Um, I don't consider leggings yoga pants, but I was definitely a legging person. Last year, I definitely did not wear skirts as often, and I did wear colored jeans a lot last year, so I was kind of like all three. Well, I absolutely hate yoga pants, that's the thing, um, so I would never wear yoga pants, but yeah. And this year, I'm planning on being more of a skirt person. I'm going to buy a lot more circle skirts because I love them. I already have like four or five and I just love them and I'm gonna just do that because I love them. The next question is backpack or purse and last year I wore a purse all year long and I did not use a backpack I just carried all my books but this year I'm thinking about getting one of the Brandy Melville backpacks because I love them I think they're so cute. I know like everybody has those style backpacks but I really like them and I really want one of the Brandy Melville ones. Next question is three must-have beauty items for school this year and basically what I mean by that is just kind of like what things that I definitely love for the school year and just great things and in general like for like the whole year not even the school year my favorite palette was definitely oh I just almost dropped it my naked two palette and this is very $50 so but it's like a really good investment honestly like I love it so much and Definitely, this is a good palette. I can do so many eyeshadow looks with it and whatever. Um, I definitely got a big use of it out of the school year. And then my number one favorite thing, like if I'm on a, in a rush and whatever, the one makeup item I wear, I choose mascara. So like my favorite um, mascara right now is the from the drugstore is Great Lash Lots of Lashes. And uh, make sure it's the Lots of Lashes one. It's not focused, but it has the heart on the bottom. And just this one is awesome, and the brush like is like kind of like a cone, but yeah, and I love it, and it's awesome. And lastly, um, I just love chapstick, and a lot of you guys know how much I love chapstick, and definitely one of the must-haves is one of the baby lips. Um, this one's the pink punch one because it does have color, and it's also moisturizing. And compared to the EOS's, it's a lot more compact, and it's easier to carry around, and yeah. Next question is, what do you do in your boring classes? Um, well, I kind of just make the best of it usually, and I just kind of stay awake. A lot of times I do, like, kind of start to doze off and daydream, and which is very bad. Don't do that. And um, in the classes that we're allowed to, I would usually just put my headphones in and listen to music while doing the silent work, which would get very boring when my teacher would be like, okay, do this work, do this many pages, blah, 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 and I would just listen to music the whole time, like, while I was doing the work, obviously, music makes things a lot easier. And the last question is, what is the biggest tip you have for someone going into the grade that you just finished? And I'm going to be a sophomore this year, so last year, um, I was in ninth grade and I was a freshman, and definitely, since it's your first year of high school, just don't walk into the high school thinking you're all cool and whatever, because you're not really, and just... I don't know, don't try too hard, nobody really cares, just wear what you feel is comfortable, and high school is definitely not scary, that's just one thing I wanted to tell you. It's scary at first, and then it's just easy, like, well, it's not easy in the classes, but definitely try hard in your classes, because it's very hard, and yeah, and I also have a freshman tips video, so I'll also leave the link down below if you guys want to watch that, if you guys are going to be a freshman this year, and you guys want some more tips. So now I tag you to film this video and post it as a video response down below and I want you guys to tag some of your friends to do this tag because we definitely want this tag to just kind of be a success and go around like people doing it and yeah so make sure to thumbs up this video and favorite it because I love favoriting and leave a comment down below telling me um what day you're going back to school and yeah it's just yeah I'll see you guys in my next back to school video, which will be this Friday. So I love you guys all.